I want to welcome everybody to the course Introduction to Global Urban Education. It is a pleasure to be a part of this project, a joint effort between Teachers Without Borders and Johns Hopkins University School of Education. My name is Fred Mednick and I'm the founder of Teachers Without Borders and very pleased to be part of an effort now that is including people like you in 23 different countries. Here's a quick video about Teachers Without Borders. We're going to touch on many different subjects in this course, too many perhaps, and any module or theme can be expanded into several different kinds of courses, but you have to start somewhere. Besides, we have no time to waste. I also want to give you an example of global education and the world of international development through a very short video about earthquake education, earthquake science, and safety. Emergency education here at Teachers Without Borders focuses on preparedness and planning. We taught a workshop in April 2009 and focused on earthquake science, safety, and mitigation. And all of these um, concepts were introduced through several interactive, hands-on, inquiry-based lesson plans. We know emergency education can save lives. We know very well that even one retrofitted school can save thousands of lives. Teachers do have, um, have a voice, and unfortunately their voices are not being heard. It's the children we're talking about here, and I want to make sure that we're doing our best to serve them, the children in our own classrooms and the children around the world. Today in the paper, I read about Syrian refugees pouring into Jordan. 60% of them are young people, and 20% of those are under the age of six years old. I think there really isn't time to waste. I think all universities and organizations need to be global in their scope. I'm proud of being associated with Johns Hopkins University, who I believe has the kinds of sensibility and value system that can really help us make a difference. So we're going to start with this course and expand it to several other projects to connect teachers with each other.